This is the iPhone 6S. From the outside, you'd be forgiven for thinking this looks just like the iPhone 6. I mean, sure, it comes in pink. No, no, no. Wait, that's the wrong phone. Shit, hold on. Stop. Stop. Are you fucking kidding me? Are, are, are we good now? I mean, are you guys fucking serious? Like, do I have the right phone? Fuck's sake, I swear to God. One is champagne, one is rosé. What the hell? Sure, it comes in pink, or as Apple insists on calling it, rose gold, but the basic design is the same. It turns out Apple has totally changed almost everything about the phone. From the type of aluminum used for the case, to the processor and camera inside, to the type of glass on the front, the iPhone 6S is a brand new beast. On the outside, there's a new stronger layer of glass, and that screen holds one of the best new features of the iPhone 6S. Like Force Touch on the MacBook and MacBook Pro and Apple Watch, 3D Touch offers users a new way to interact with the phone. Press in a little bit on an app icon and you'll get access to what Apple calls quick actions. These actions let you access certain functions from inside the app automatically. But that's not all 3D Touch can do. Inside apps that support 3D Touch, there exists the notion of peek and pop. A light press on a link, a photo, or a message in a list will open up a preview of what you've selected using what Apple calls peek. Press a bit harder and you'll pop directly to the next web page, photo, or message. For me, 3D Touch is something that once you use, you won't be able to stop using. The camera on the iPhone 6S gets a big upgrade from the iPhone 6. It's now 12 megapixels, and Apple says that this new sensor is even better at noise reduction and in low light. In addition to the better sensor, the iPhone 6S has a new photo mode called Live Photos. Live Photos, quite simply, are awesome! The mode takes an extra 1.5 seconds of audio and photo frames before and after your shots. The result is that when viewed on an iOS 9 device or a Mac running El Capitan, you can see those photos move. Pressing and holding the photo will play it back. The front-facing FaceTime camera is now 5 megapixels, and finally, selfies look good. When it comes to video, Apple joined the 4K party, and even though you can't play back the 4K video natively, you can zoom in to see the detail you're missing. Siri on the iPhone 6S is now always listening, except when in a pocket or purse. You can even train Siri to recognize just your voice. This isn't a security feature. My coworker successfully impersonated me. Hey Siri. Oh, shit. What the hell? Oh shit. <laughs> How can I help? <laughs> no! The real story of the iPhone 6S is 3D touch and the new camera and live photos. These two features make the phone feel like a compelling upgrade. 